So I just went for a slow drive. I drove like Miss Daisy um, to the local pharmacy. I came back and just before I parked my car, I realized I have uh, the dreaded engine light on. Um, hmm. I bet this has something to do with the sport cut. Not something I was expecting. Uh, but I think I'm gonna have to investigate it. Luckily, I have a Beamer link um, so I can check what's going on. Still on. Right, let's start Beamer link. Beamerlink found two errors related to the uh, lambda sensor. Interestingly, it's the first lambda sensor, which is called pre-catalytic converter lambda, rather than the one after the cat, which I would expect to cause problems, if anything, with the sport cat. I do have that 90 degree lambda extension, um, which meant to stop anything like that from happening. So hopefully this will never ever return and I'm not sure why it actually happened. I realized after uh, scanning it again that the problem is still there. One of the errors didn't clear. However, this error, it states that it would not cause the light. So that's interesting. I will keep my eye on it. Um, so not really sure um, if I should be worried or not. However, um, the error disappeared now from the dash. There's nothing on it. Um, so, um, yeah, hopefully this is the last video about this problem you're seeing on my channel. Uh, but I would be really interested to hear from you guys. What do you do with sport filters? Um, do you have any 90 degree extensions? Something which uh, helps to prevent um, the EML light to come up. As you know, I don't have um, any boot mode or anything like that where I could code it out. Um, so uh, I'm purely relying on that little um, unit to uh, reduce the fumes flow um, so the lambda doesn't throw any errors but obviously something's not right um, like I said I will monitor the situation hopefully it will not come back um, I will take it for a test drive maybe and find out if uh, it's working fine if it doesn't reduce power or anything like that but yeah let me know in the comment section if you experience eml lights uh, because of the sport cut uh, what did you do to fix it and uh, yeah maybe there is some kind of magic solution apart from uh, coding it out with uh, boot mode uh, or mhd um, so yeah looking forward to hear from you guys i hope you enjoyed this short video Thank you for watching please remember like and subscribe and i'll see you shortly in the next one thank you for watching goodbye do widzenia